Welcome to the Tradex Foods 3-Minute Market Insight. Here is the seafood news for the week of June 24, 2013. Russian salmon supply has been a buzz in the market over the past few weeks, as short supply shortages worsen for North American processed sockeye and pink salmon. With more companies looking to conduct trade with Russia, buyers should exercise extreme caution when purchasing. There are quite the number of factors to require due diligence on the part of importers and program buyers to ensure your supply needs are met. Two significant factors are processor registration and payment terms. Firstly, not all processors will have FDA registration numbers, which will prevent import into the USA. There have been instances where USA buyers purchase product, pay for part or all of the cargo in Russia before finding out the fish was not able to be legally imported into the US. Secondly, many processors require payment when product loads Russia or arrives in Busan, Korea. If buyers aren't thorough, they may pay the price when product goes into production. Meanwhile, as fish markets negotiate prices and contracts, Russian processors are preparing for the 2013 sockeye and pink salmon harvest. Sockeye are running late, according to processors in Russia, due to cold water temperatures resulting from snowpack conditions. Sockeye are expected to start in one to two weeks and continue until late into the summer. Pink salmon runs are expected to arrive in Russia rivers around the second week of July. Preseason estimate for Russian pink salmon harvest is approximately 170 million fish, up nearly 50 million fish over last year's harvest. This high estimation of harvest is not necessarily good news for the pink salmon market. Alaska is also expecting a large production year, estimating up to 140 million fish, almost double the 2012 run. Some Russian packers have indicated they may reduce production in light of a possible oversupply. One packer noted they are considering limiting pink production to 3,000 metric tons despite their ability to produce up to 7,000 metric tons. The Russian pink salmon price is not settled with buyers looking for lower prices than 2012. Buyers should expect strong supply of 2,000 pinks for 2013 as it appears at this point and lower prices than last year. Thank you for joining me for the Tradex Foods 3-Minute Market Insight. This is Ken Radcliffe. Buy smart and eat more seafood.